All right, so this problem is asking us to set up and solve a system of equations based on the information given in the problem. So uh, we're given that fish costs $6.50 a pound, lobster costs $9.50 a pound. A total of 20.5 pounds is sold for it to make $155.75. So our first equation here is F to represent the number of pounds of fish plus L, the number of pounds of lobster, equals 20.5 because we have a total of 20.5 pounds sold. And then $6.50 times F plus $9.50 times L equals $155.75. So there's our system of equations. That's the, the first half of the problem done right there. Now to solve it, it gets a little trickier. We're going to take our first one here. We're going to subtract F from both sides um, just to get L by itself. And uh, we get L equals 20.5 minus F. We use that. Substitute it into our second equation to get $6.50 times F plus $9.50 times 20.5 minus F equals $155.75. Uh, as we distribute that through, we get that that uh, $9.50 times 20.5 minus F is $194.75 minus $9.50 times F. We're going to combine those like terms there to get that it's 194.75 minus three dollars times F equals 155.75. I don't like dealing with the with the negatives on there, so we're going to go ahead and just switch the sides on this. Basically, we're going to add three dollars times F to both sides. We're also at the same time just going to go ahead and subtract 155 dollars and 75 cents from both sides. This that's what's going on with this line. Um, you can split that into multiple steps or even skip right by this step if you're comfortable with exactly what's going on here. But what we're left with is that 194.75 minus 155.75 is $39. Um, then, of course, the $3 times S, they're going to cancel each other out. And again, our 155.75s, they're going to cancel each other out. We're left with $3 times F. So uh, $39 equals $3 times F. We divide both sides by $3. We get that F equals 13. Um, then we're going to substitute that back into this L equals 20.5 minus F. So L equals 20.5 minus 13. You have this L equals 7.5. Once we're to that point, um, that should be our solution. We can uh, go ahead and pull out a calculator and just make sure that that works out for us. So $6.50 times 13 pounds uh, gives us $84.50. 7.5 times... $9.50 a pound gives us $71.25. Um, we add those two together, we get $155.75. So we do, in fact, have 20.5 pounds, $155.75. So this does satisfy the uh, parameters given in the problem, and it is our correct solution. I hope that helps. Thanks.